everything you love is gone. There is no hope. There is no God. Just let go so you can let me. My own man. Away from the world. It's a beautiful thing. My own man. Away from the world. It's a beautiful thing. And it's not going to make us any money, then why? And those are your two polarities? Polarities? Priorities or whatever. Money's just money. You got to take that out of the equation. Now what? Well, that's what I'm saying. It's not just money. No, no, you can find a reason, and I want to find out what happens, too. So no money, and what have you got left? You got other people. You got Clara. You got time. Time's a big one, but you've got about as much as anyone else, give or take.
What about God? Maybe you've got God, do you? Do I have God? Yes. No. Okay. Well, here's how I break it down. A writer writes a novel. A songwriter writes a song. A symphonist writes a symphony. Which is maybe the best example because all the best ones were written for God. So, tell me what happens if Beethoven's writing is... physics. So Beethoven says, shoot, God doesn't exist, so I guess I'm writing this for other people. It's just nuts and bolts now. He didn't have any children that I can recall, but if he did... He had a nephew. He had what? A nephew. He had a nephew. Okay, great. So he, he writes it for him. Let's leave love out of this, and then let's wrap this all up under the blanket of something thinking this is something that they'll remember me for. And they did, and we do. And sure enough, we do what we can to endure. We build our legacy piece by piece. Maybe the whole world will remember you, or maybe just a couple of people, but you can do. Make sure you're still around after you're gone. And so, we're still reading this book. Stranger. 